Hello, my name is Philip, and I'm a developer here with Ashley Audio. In this video, I'm going to show you how to load a design in your Ashley Remote iPad app. For demonstration purposes, I am running the simulator on my computer. When you first load up your iPad app, um, you will see uh, the Ashley logo at the bottom here and whatever design that you've been working on or if you don't have a design you'll just see a blank page here like what I have um, this is live mode so if you have a design you can interact with it but we need to get to edit mode so we can load up our design so let's touch the Ashley logo here at the bottom that brings us into edit mode in edit mode we have a bunch of new buttons here we're looking for the miscellaneous button then we are going to touch the file options button and this will bring up a list of all of the files that are saved in our iPad app. Um, every iPad app comes with an example file so that's what we're using in this tutorial. Um, go ahead and select the example uh, file and then click the load button. Now you'll notice you get a warning here. This warning um, is here because when you load up a design you're actually wiping out whatever design is currently in the working settings um, so you want to be careful that you've already saved out your design um, and that way uh, you don't erase it permanently so I don't have a design here so I'm not worried about that I'm just gonna load up this example file there we go now I've loaded it and um, I can see from down here I have a page menu I can select in here and look at all the pages that have been loaded up they all look okay so I'm gonna go to live mode and now I can see I can interact with my design um, and it's now loaded on the iPad and that's pretty much all you have to do to load in your design um, thanks for watching bye